Hey, welcome back to the Gazelle Gadget Lab. This is Anthony. Today we have the new uh, Apple iPad tablet computer. We're going to do a little informal unboxing on the device. I'll probably do a full review in the, in the next couple of weeks once I get some apps on here and have some time to play with it. So let's just take a look at the new iPad. This is the 16 gigabyte version, Wi-Fi. I the 3G model comes out uh, a little bit later. So a pretty simple box, just like a kind of like a big i i iPhone or uh, iTouch box. So, so let's take this thing off. So, here's the, app, the iPad. Still got the protective uh, screen on it. I'll turn it on in a couple seconds. Let's take a look what else is in the box. We have little documents, probably some uh, quick start guide. And then all you have in here is uh, the charger and the cable. So pretty simple packaging, and let's take a look at the iPad. I'm just going to pull off this wrap right here. So here's our, our iPad, let's power it on. I've already set this up with iTunes, so you're not going to see that classic first screen where you need to plug in. Let's wait for this thing to power on real quick. I think the, the idea of the iPad is pretty cool. I'm not really sure what still I'm gonna use it for yet. I think it's really ideal if you, if you travel, you wanna use it with the new iBooks, you wanna use it for internet, YouTube. Obviously there's a ton of games out there and everything. But if you got the, if you got the extra money to blow on this thing, I think it's, pretty, it's a pretty cool device. So here's the main, uh, the main screen. And you obviously have the other, once you fill in some apps, you can put some apps in there, kind of just like iPhone. So here's the browser. You take a look at it. And uh, I already connected to our Wi Fi here at work. And you can see, if you want to take a look at the, the on screen keyboard, you can see it in portrait mode and in landscape. It looks pretty comfortable to type with, so it doesn't look that bad. It's pretty full. Once you get used to it, I'm sure you'll be able to fly on it pretty quickly. So then you have your other, just your calendar, contacts, notes, uh, maps. It's got the built-in GPS, videos, YouTube, uh, iTunes, App Store, and your settings. We can take a look at these settings in here. So it's still the, it's giving me pretty much all your basic stuff right here. Serial number, model, your version, still 3.2. No update yet. So it's a pretty simple UI. It's pretty easy to use. Uh, once I get into this and put some apps on here, I'll have a, a pretty full, full review. One thing I notice is it is a, a it is a pretty decent size. Nice. It's got a nice weight to it, a nice feel, but it is uh, a fingerprint magnet, and it can get pretty dirty. So we got a invisible shield here from our good friends at Zag. We're probably going to throw this on here and keep it a uh, nice and scratch free. And keep the keep the life on this thing pretty well. So expect the full review in a couple of weeks. Uh, thanks for joining us. This is Anthony with the Gazelle Gadget Lab. Thanks.